My idea is already crumbling. Yo, 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 my people. Today, I'm attempting to build a stunning hoop dance studio in Bloxburg. So let's get into it. So you might not know that one of my huge hobbies is hoop dancing. And maybe you don't even know what hoop dancing is, but essentially you use a hula hoop and you can do all these different tricks and put them together. And then you're essentially dancing with the hula hoop. <laughs> and in our most recent update, it was a huge like gym athletic type of thing. And so we got some hula hoops. Where did you go there's one and then there's the other more plain and this has been a dream of mine y'all to have a hula hoop in all of my building games and life simulation games yes please but we need to put these over to the side because we have to actually build the studio itself so right here you can see exactly the kind of vibe i'm going for these bora bora like resort hotel stay thingies are exactly the vibe and since we're getting to summertime I figured we might as well do a summery theme why not okay so here is the plan the master plan to make this absolutely stunning. I forget that pools cannot start at the beginning. That's so sad. But we're going to have a beautiful watery pathway up to it. I'm hoping I can kind of make it curve a bit. It's super unfortunate that the pools can't like, I don't know, cut corners and be diagonal. But I'm hoping to make this somehow a bit more rounded. This is so expensive, y'all. And this is the small, shallow pool too. Okay, that's going to be way more than enough space, right? I have regrets. I have regrets. It's going to be on the second story right but also seeing that now that is so high to the second story so maybe i don't know i was gonna say maybe we shouldn't have it that high and just have it on the first floor so i was hoping that we could do like a cylinder just to make it super rounded out but that's not even big enough y'all my idea is already crumbling <laughs> okay i was testing something out because i was having a panic attack so i didn't really want to talk too much not literally i wasn't actually having a panic attack i just was freaking out trying to figure out what to do but this might be the solution if we use what are these called i don't even know if we use these basic shapes essentially it's bigger still probably not big enough <laughs> but i think i have yet another solution for this so i'm gonna move both of these over towards the middle where they ought to be now we just need two more of those okay there's the final one and then we're gonna need some more basic shapes we're gonna use a cube this time there you are why can i not put this on top of the other one that's so rude okay but do you see how this is all coming together oh my gosh that was perfect okay i am just putting in the last piece and look at that we have a bit of a foundation for our studio now let's see if we can get some support going on I feel like a round pillar makes the most sense oh i didn't think about the fact that it probably wouldn't let me put it in the pool how do i do this wait I can put it when I'm in the pool like this oh I see okay hold up wait what is happening oh I was looking in the wrong spot I was putting it in the basement not in the actual pool yo this is the pool this is the basement <gasps> hey that is not even too bad I don't know how I accidentally <laughs> got it in a pretty good spot yes two for two took two tries on the second one but we got it eventually okay at least with this one I have two to help me I think that should be right yes okay so we've got four something in me says we need more than that for it to truly be enough okay we'll do more we are supported <laughs> we're floating out of the water yay let's try for a roof i'm curious to see exactly where the roof lands here i don't know that feels a bit short to me but we need to test this out for ourselves for real so let's go ahead and get a bit of a staircase going for us then i have no idea whether i'm gonna do this well i am kind of just winging it at this point <laughs> okay yay there's something that might be refined a bit later but i gotta test if we can get up there and how short it is oh no that feels really short y'all i'm scared oh i fell in the water okay that is way too short okay if we did the hollow mansard roof at the same level that might work out for us so i think this technically works i am worried that i don't like the look of it as much but you know what the more i do to it like making it taller i think the more i like it okay let's check you out now okay so this definitely works better because of course we have way more space above our heads so i think we'll go with that next up we do know right that this pool is way too big truly what it is is it's not rounded out enough so i'm hoping i can fix that a little bit and i just realized i totally did that in 
the wrong place. That's the wrong direction, girly. Okay, so we're gonna do something like this. Oh my gosh, this is gonna work, y'all. It's gonna work. Now it looks way more circular, but we still need to change this grass or the floor to grass. <laughs> if you didn't figure out yet what we were doing, that's what we're doing. Woohoo, see? Now to pull that off on this little rivery part <laughs> as well. Can we do that? I don't know. Okay, y'all, I did it. <laughs> it took a lot of like adding one tile or two tiles of pool plus floors that are in little corners like this, especially half tiles. There we go. It's nice and curved. And once we get some more greenery on there, it'll be even more so. One more major, major part of this that I want to show y'all is how this is going to be a water pathway up to the stairs, but we can still walk it. Because <laughs> you might be wondering what the heck is happening there. I don't know if this is going to look good, but we all know my love for daisies on this channel. And I've seen people use these daisy pillows as like a little stepping stone, but like on the grass. But now we are going to use it as a stepping stone across water. Yes, indeedy. So sadly, it doesn't get nearly as big as I'd hoped, but I think it'll still be okay. Probably just have to do a ton of them. And of course, they'll probably be colored differently, but let's just see if this works. <gasps> it totally works, y'all. It totally works. So just imagine a whole path of them up to there and it's gonna be beautiful. And honestly, you don't have to imagine it because you're gonna see it in a moment anyway. Okay, y'all, I was gonna come back when I was completely done with this build, but I just have to shout out Unborn Player, which you can see he's mashed up there with me because it looks like my name is Unborn Player. But Unborn Player is helping me with gardening because it's really intense and I'm kind of doing some of the things that they usually do. I put in like all of these cherry blossom trees besides this one over here that's already green. I've done most of the gardening that you can already see. So I just wanted to shout out Umbral Player. Just so you know, I'm not the only one that did it and I wanted to make sure I got some of the recording as Umbral Player was actually doing it and not just mention it after the fact. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, y'all, I finished building my hoop dance studio and it is my dream hoop dance studio. If only I could have this in real life. And thanks again to Unborn Player for all the help. I could not have pulled this off without Unborn Player, I'm telling you. So I think you already saw this because I did record a bit of a cinematic thing. But here we have it, our little daisy walkway. I do wish there was like even more greenery on the sides because like I imagine this like kind of in a very, very lush area, but it's still a good enough representation of what I wanted. All of these transparent decals and all of the gardening was a lot. <laughs> so I wish I could have done a lot more, but this is what we have. And here we have the actual studio. It's very simple. I mean, just mostly a lot of green and and boho vibes and let's just grab ourselves a hoop too bad we can't like actually dance oh once you move it kind of goes off but that's the idea there's my hoop dance studio oh i love it if only this could be real life Alrighty, y'all thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this and if you did don't forget to like comment and subscribe i love you all so much and i will see you next time bye ah we're just gonna record <laughs> I literally did not color, oh my gosh.